Running a full 26.2 miles is a big feat for some, but how about doing it twice back to back? CBS 3's Natalie Grant shares the unique way one longtime Grandma's Marathon runner takes on the course. On the morning of Grandma's Marathon, runners usually start their day with an early alarm, maybe a light breakfast, and they're on their way out the door up to the Two Harbors starting line. But for one Missouri man, that starting line is only a halfway point. Turned out to be just one of those things I do each year. Eric Strand has been running grandmas since 2000, when his running career took off. As he grew in skill, so did the number of miles he'd race, eventually landing him at the Leadville 100 in Colorado, a 100-mile marathon. To train for a 100-mile race, one of the best things you can do is just be on your feet for like 8 to 10 hours at a time moving forward. Forward. And so I uh, had a training run scheduled for Grandma's weekend, and 26.2 miles simply wasn't long enough. With 26.2 not cutting it for Strand anymore, he decided in 2012 to start his Grandma's Marathon morning in Canal Park, running up to the starting line in Two Harbors and back with the rest of the field. He's coined it the Grandma's Double. The roads are quiet. There's not much going on at 2.33 in the morning, and it's beautiful watching the sunrise over Lake Superior, watching the whole race course wake up with all the volunteers. Over the years, Strand says others have joined him for his run to the starting line, including his own sons. He says after all these years, Grandma's continues to be his favorite race and keeps him coming back year after year. It has such community support with the volunteers, with the crowds, and even though you're a fairly average runner, they make you feel like a rock star. Ready once again to lace up his running shoes Saturday in the dead of night to knock out 52 miles by the shores of Lake Superior. Strand tells us he will keep running grandma's doubles as long as he can and once he is done he hopes his sons take over the tradition.